We took our three kids on a wild tiger search. Did we find them? Karen, how do you feel? That was, that was incredible. Please join us for this amazing adventure. Thank you so much for watching our channel. We are so grateful for you. We had to find the best place to see a wild tiger. We decided on Nagarhole National Park and stayed at the Jungle Inn. Inn. Nagarhole, we're leaving by uh, Uber. We're gonna take a train. And then our buddy Satish is gonna pick us up. And we are going to go to a beautiful area where hopefully we'll see some cool animals, right? Oh yeah. Jungle Inn was a mixture of paved and dirt roads. The Jungle Inn is overflowing with nature. There's lots of trees, flowers, and interesting pathways that take you through the entire property. A great beginning for our tiger journey. The Jungle Inn is a very cozy place where you can walk around on the lush grounds, you can sit down by the fire pit, or if you're hungry, you can head over to the dinner area called the Troon Restaurant and they offer breakfast, lunch, and dinner. The interior is very comfortable, plenty of seats open, and they cook food for uh, you three times a day. Exactly. It's really surprising to me is just how we're actually close to a big town but um, this place feels like it's in the middle of nowhere, which is exactly what we were looking for, something that's very mellow and easygoing. Um, but overall, we're so far, we're very impressed with what we see. Wow. Set, go! Whoa, nice job. That took some effort. Not really. We started with a hike to explore the area and happened upon the farms where our food is grown. We saw pumpkin, green chilies, onion, and ginger. Why is this so fun? Next, we began our wildlife journey by Jeep. We were really excited to hike to the waterfall, but when we got there, we got some bad news. It turns out there was an elephant on the trail and thus they had to close the trail. Too bad for us. No tiger sightings today, so we headed back to play some cards and get ready for the next day. 
It started raining, and it was our first time experiencing rain in India. It's raining in India. Uh, this is our first rain in two months. Yay! Yeah! Can I do one more? Yeah. Better at night. Serious rain, y'all. <laughs> Daddy, you gotta come in here. Ready, set, go. Woo! Ah, no, Daddy! Go again, yeah, go again. Finally. Julian, guys, I'm gonna run in the rain for my go! Now that was a real jingle, or that's what my dad would say. Our tiger search continues on day two. One of the animals on our bucket list was the elephant, and coming across it was an extremely exciting event. Elephants are magnificent creatures, but they can be territorial, especially when it comes to their offspring. We made sure to keep a safe distance. While we were gone, some monkeys made themselves at home in the room next door. I really hope that this monkey didn't get a single occupancy rate for this room. As we were headed back, we saw some elephants and we were about to go back to the jungle inn. We did not expect what would happen next. We just saw a tiger. That was incredible. <laughs> While driving down a narrow dirt road, I caught a glimpse of an orange streak out of the corner of my eye. Oh my gosh, guys, look. Look to the side. It's a tiger. Oh my gosh. It just crawled right out of the brush. Oh my goodness. <laughs> The tiger literally appeared out of the brush and calmly slinked its way down the road as we followed him very quietly.
just like that, she walked right back into the brush. That was crazy. We just saw a tiger. <laughs>